Hi everyone, I'm Kara Taylor and I'm going to show you the makeup look I'm doing for an event during fashion week. So I'm going to start with skincare and this oil cleanser and all I do is rub it in. Okay, so the first thing I do is take off my makeup that I had from maybe previous shows or anything like that since it is fashion week. I get so much makeup on my skin. I usually don't wear makeup during fashion week because, you know, people want you to have clean skin and they want to see your natural complexion, which mine is a little damaged right now with my pimples. But usually I'm all natural, even if I have pimples. Alrighty, now I'm going to rinse this off. So the next thing I do is I just use a face wash that my dermatologist prescribed to me. So this face wash was prescribed to me because my skin is just super, super sensitive. So I need something that's pretty natural so my skin doesn't break out. Now I'm gonna rinse this off. So I'm gonna use these eye patches. They're super nice, they're from Paris. They're all natural and they're just, there's a really nice cooling sensation when you put them on and they make you feel all cool. I always do it the other way. So now we'll do this side. Bam. So now I'm gonna put on the, one of these Biore strip things. First, what you have to do with these, you have to make sure your nose is super wet so it sticks on and gets hard and everything. So now, I'm gonna wait 10 minutes for this to dry up and make sure it sucks everything in, and then I'll take everything off. So I mostly use these nose strips just for fun with my boyfriend, cause we think it's super satisfying when, when we pull it off and then there's all that gunk. So now, I'm just gonna take this off. So much came off, that's so cool. Okay, anyway, science project over. Bam, she's ready. So now I'm just gonna use this serum from Eileen Tulura. I'm gonna do three drops and just. So now, um, now that I use the serum, I'm gonna use the oil that goes with it. This is the warm season oil because it's still kind of summer. So, um, but she has like a cold season one for when it's winter too. So I'm just gonna do a couple drops. It smells really good too. And just tap that in. Bam. I learned how to um, do all this skincare stuff from just like being backstage at shows, lots of people's advice and everything. Like you hear so many people talk about skincare cause like makeup artists, that's their whole like life. So they, they give you some really amazing tips about skincare, which is really helpful and important. A lot of makeup artists tell you that you should do your neck because your neck skin is also very sensitive and, and thin. So if your face looks flawless and then you got a saggy neck, that's a little bit weird, right? So don't forget the neck. I'm just going to go in with my sunscreen. It's by this brand Ren. I try to stay all natural because that's when my skin reacts the best to things where is when there's chemicals and your skin could react badly to it. So I try to keep my skincare super clean and all that good stuff. So now I'm just going to go in with this Caudalie spray. It's super nice, makes you feel good and then like Having that little spritz is always super duper fun to do. Now my skin is done and I'm gonna start with the makeup. So now I'm just gonna do a little eyelash curl. Bam. So I have this NARS concealer and I'm not very good at matching it so don't make fun of me, but it'll look good, I promise. I have like mini ones just because um, there, it, it's a lot easier to travel with, but I also think they're really cute. So I buy all the small ones because it's more fun. Now, I usually just tap it in with my finger. I find that works the best. I'm not very good at covering up spots. I just wanna like, I don't want them to be as red. 
And I'm fine with it because, I mean, everyone has pimples and everyone gets it. Everyone goes through that. For a lot of people, Fashion Week is super duper duper like crazy and scary. But I mean, it's just su such an amazing thing because you're spending a month with so many creative people and you get to you get to experience the makeup artist creativity and the designer's creativity and just like you see like their vision just comes tr like comes true which is so crazy to me my favorite city is definitely new york it's a little bit easier for me just because like it's my time zone i can still talk to my friends and everything and i'm not jet lagged most importantly that's a big that's a big deal for me because i get it bad so if you haven't already noticed i'm a little bit sick um, just because you're like running around, you're in the subway and everything and it's just not clean. Could be air conditioning or whatever. So a ginger shot or a turmeric ginger shot is really, really, really awesome. So this won't be pretty, but I'm just gonna do it. It'll help. Oh. Yeah! Milk highlighter, it's super nice. It's just a super natural, super cute, simple highlighter that just is just, it's like, is it there? Is she wearing highlighter? Ooh. I was scouted on Instagram, which is so weird to me because all of my Instagram pictures were smiling pictures and I looked doofy and like stupid and everything. But they they're like, oh, she's tall. I guess we'll go in for a meeting. And then I went in for a meeting and they, they liked me. So a month later, I did fashion week. Now I'm just gonna do a little bit of a brow gel. I don't really necessarily do much to my brows just because I like them the way they are. Just add a little bit of color and brush them through. Bam. The palette that I have is just a drugstore palette. It's Milani palette. So I'm going to do this color. Bam. So I'm just going to go in and do just a light little bit of color. I only have this brush. It's a double ended brush. But if I had more, then things will get complicated. And then I just go a little bit crazy. So this keeps me, this keeps me doing stuff that I know what to do. The moment I really realized that modeling like was my career was I think it was my second season and um, I opened Chanel which was so crazy to me like I showed up at the show and they gave me this card with like our number and mine said number one and it didn't I didn't even like think about it I was just like oh okay so I know I have to go over there and I'll just figure out where I'll go. Cause I was also kind of new and didn't know exactly what I was doing. So then I, I get there and I'm like, hey, where do I go? And they're like, oh, you're at the front of the line. And I was like, so it, it clicked. I was like, I'm opening Chanel. Like that's so crazy to me. And I was like 15, which is such an amazing accomplishment for a 15 year old, even for anyone really. I'm just gonna take the other end, the small end of this and do just a little bit on the lash line so it, it looks good. One season I did 40 shows, 40 whole shows. Well, almost 40 shows. It was super crazy, but I was having so much fun and I thought it was such a cool thing to do that I didn't even notice I was doing so many shows. So now that I have the this basic like color now, I, I'm going to add a little bit of this Urban Decay shimmery thing. So I really think it's beautiful when people put eyeshadow or like shiny eyeshadow like in the inner corner. So I love doing it. I don't know. I think it's just fun and I love sparkles. So it adds just a little bit of something but not too much. What I'm going to do is is use this one right here just to make sure it's blended a little bit 
And so like the shimmer isn't just a random shimmer and it kind of like works. Of course, I'm gonna do mascara. I have another mini one. This is from Tarte. Oh gosh, I done messed up. So mascara's on. And the last step I'm gonna do is lips. What I usually do is use a gloss, but the 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 chapstick or like glossy thing I like the most is this NARS thing. And it's super nice because it adds like a little tint and a little shine. And it's just super classy and simple. I also love Pat McGrath's lip gloss. She's so major, she knows exactly what she's doing. And if you want to amp up the look a little bit more, you just add a little touch of that. And done. I have this fresh roller ball. It's sugar lychee. And then I use this vanilla perfume. And then both together is heaven. I always do some right here right here and here and then spray on the other perfume and oh, I'm smelling good for days mm. well I hope you guys liked it I know I'm no makeup professional but I had so much fun filming this and I hope you guys enjoyed thanks for watching bye